a dance recital in Hiawatha is happening a little early, call it a mini recital, to give a father the opportunity to see his daughter perform. That father, Stephen Stepanek, has an aggressive form of brain cancer. And as KCRG TV 9's Emily Schrod shows us, a dance studio ensure he would see a six-year-old daughter, Sylvia, doing what she loves. Steven Stepanek was diagnosed with glioblastoma in August of 2022. Fighting brain cancer is just, it's so hard and you can't do it alone. And every patient and family going through this need the community behind them. He's had surgery, radiation and chemotherapy. Seven months after his initial diagnosis in March, the family was told Stephen's cancer was recurrent and his treatments to slow the cancer weren't working. Now they say they're making the most of the time they have together. <laughs> Stephen's six-year-old daughter, Sylvia, dances at the Dancer's Edge in Hiawatha. Dance is my daughter's happy place and so for them to get behind her and our family just means so much because we know that they're going to be there for her every step of the way through our fight now and for the rest of her career with them. And this is why we do dance because it gives her an outlet. Their annual recital typically takes place in June. But with the uncertainty that comes with a cancer diagnosis, the dance studio helped make sure Stephen got the chance to see his daughter take the stage with a mini recital. Tonight's just an example of gifts that they've given us, memories that we can keep forever. And so we're so thankful that all of these people have gone out of their way just to do one more act for us to make sure that we have a moment that we can keep. But to be able to give this opportunity when he's well enough to come out um, and sit in the chair and watch his daughter with a smile on her face in her costume, whether it be on a stage or here in the dance room, we're just happy to provide the opportunity. While emotions were running high during the performance, one in particular stuck out to the Stepanek family. Watching Sylvia dance tonight and also watching Steven's reaction is is really surreal because, you know, I fear that we may not get those moments in the future. And it's just, I'm so happy we made that happen tonight. And that was Emily Schron reporting. Now, Stephen's team is planning a second surgery for later this month, followed by a high-dose radiation. It is a last attempt for a little more time and improved quality of life.